hello you guys welcome to november 11 it is 11 11 what a divinely blessed day to clean all the old patterns people energies that do not serve you right and to spread the joy and manifest and bring in new energies and high vibe in your life that is good for you I have been doing my cleansing ritual today where um, I have lit this candle for divine guidance uh, these candles are available with us so please email or whatsapp on the number below you can also use them for meditation some of them are crystal infused we also have non crystal infused as well we do have manifestation candles as well so you can just check that out as well uh, just send me a whatsapp for your query apart from that welcome to this extremely abundant day i wish you all guys an extreme amount of abundance health wealth prosperity and magic in your manifestation okay so um so long that you have been thinking uh, you know where is my life heading what am i doing what do i need to do um, how do i work along whatever and if you've not find solution look at this reading as a solution as an answer to all your questions okay wherein uh, we will check you know what is it that you need to let go and what is it that you need to accept so uh, just before Diwali, before Christmas, before any occasions, we generally clean our entire space in our house, right? Now our space, our house, our working area is an extension to who we are, to what we are and to how we want it to be. If it's messy, then your life is also going to be messy. If it's clean, your life is also going to be clean, right? Because what you see you will resonate you'll pick that energy you'll feel the vibe all the time right that is what is going to happen to you so accordingly ensure that you also clean up your mental area okay i'm channeling guys the minute the video starts i just start channeling and that's what i am getting as a message for you guys to start cleaning up your mental space and your mental area as well while some of you I I'm channeling and I feel that a lot of you who've tuned in right now have started a very healthy lifestyle which is good for the ones who've not maybe it's time for you to start your healthy lifestyle start eating healthy okay uh, try your best to meditate or just take a walk okay maybe a lot of you just need to take a walk you can do that and uh, give yourself okay please listen to this and listen to this carefully okay give yourself five minutes in the morning when you wake up if not much just to remain quiet just to breathe and be in stillness and awareness of your breath try your best not to think anything see thoughts are gonna keep coming thoughts are gonna keep flowing don't try to fixate yourself into the thought whenever there is a thought that comes to your head which is not something that you want first thing in the morning say cancel cancel that thought and literally say the word cancel and come back come back to your awareness okay um, come back to the awareness of your breath do that all right so I'm sorry about this camera it just keeps moving all right so try your best to come back to that awareness all right do that okay uh, that's what you need to do all right And oh my god look at this this is like a shaky breezy situation happening with me right now <laughs> Talk about this okay okay I'm sorry I hope this doesn't happen again and uh, in the night as well before you go to bed give that five minutes to yourself uh, go back in the whole breathing process okay 
and uh, get into the awareness of your breathing and give yourself that mental clarity and space. This is a channeled message, so I'm just going to say whatever comes out right there. All righty. Okay. All righty. All righty. Let's start your reading. Bottom of the deck. The Hermit. Look at this beautiful card. Wow. I just love it when the universe validates what I have to say. Go find your inner peace. Find your inner strength, your inner self. Go back to a place of zero. Go back to a place of zero. Extremely imperative, you guys. See, there's a death card. There's a transformation waiting for you. There's a transformation waiting for you to occur and happen. Okay self-love beautiful so what you really need to accept in your life and start working on as per your november 11 reading is self-love clean out all the self disparity that you had if somebody's pushed you down or if recent past you you have felt for any reason that you're not worthy enough get out of that mode get into the self-love mode because you know, self-love is absolute necessary. Even if you have to love somebody else, you need to get in the element of loving yourself first. How can you love somebody else if you do not love yourself? Even if the most prettiest looking woman or man stands in front of the mirror for five minutes, they will start taking off flaws. Oh, my nose is like this. My skin is imperfect, whatever. That is not self-love. That's your appearance, okay? You have to accept yourself the way you are, who you are and which element you are. Communication, for a lot of you, communication is the key because a reunion could bring love or a rekindling of friendship. A lucky win seems likely. So I'm channeling that a lot of you could have stopped communicating with somebody due to ego or due to some, in, some possibility that did not work very well between the two of you uh maybe a reunion could be on the horizon but you need to communicate clearly about your feelings your thoughts and how you feel about a certain situation only if you're able to bring in the tool of communication on the table so will the next process happen so will the relationship go further either as friends cordials or lovers or father mother could be any relationship or boss or you know colleague but you need to communicate extremely extremely clearly okay let's i'm going to keep this aside because i want space to check for tarot and i'm going to use this later okay wow ten of cups look at this beautiful so what you're looking for is a family time what you're looking for is happiness what you're looking for is a new beginning of some sort okay again communication plays a very imperative role here what you're looking for is the sun to shine on your face bright it's metaphor guys but take it how it resonates okay you're waiting for a new beginning you're waiting for happiness you're waiting for um, celebration somebody could be expecting uh, a bun in the oven somebody could be pregnant somebody uh, you know could be um, what do you say uh, planning a pregnancy or Somebody just wants to celebrate and have fun with their family, their loved ones. Uh, you know, they want to shatter and crumble beliefs and thoughts that was not right in this situation. So that is what you want to accept in life. Okay, that is what you want to accept. You want to accept a good time. You want to accept a happy time. You want to accept memories uh, that you're going to reminisce and remember for the rest of your life. Okay, uh, somebody is really, really in a long distance relationship and somebody has been looking over situations that did not work right but above that is the card of happiness maybe you're looking for this family reunion or a reunion with this person okay and you did not do right or the person did not do right by you and you were very sad about this okay but now things are going to change so you need to let go of the past you need to let go so you need to start communicating and confronting you need to bring the tool of communication on the table 
a lot of you are going to be working on the new money there is a new deal new money new uh, new beginnings happening in your life in terms of career finances and romance as well you will be going all out you will be going all out working your magic and you will ensure uh, that everything that you have thought about which is towards the best and which is going to be successful comes in fruition okay some of you had this you know whole sour milk situation that has happened in the past but the sun card is here that means you're going to enjoy a good time with this person with your family with your friends and that is what you want to accept okay and that is exactly what you need to accept and you need to clean out the situation that did not work right for you you need to clean out the mess that did not work right for you how do you do that it's up to you we can only guide you to connect to your inner peace and your inner level we can only guide you here to connect to your true self get into the mode of self realization uh, if my my uh, recording hit 11 11 and passed that so really some of you need to get into the mode of self realization because there is a huge transformation waiting for you okay there is a metaphor metamorphosis situation you're going to get into the catharsis mode right for you to get into the catharsis mode for you to understand that there is there is a new beginning post this row post this line but that new beginning is in your hands it's in your mental capacitation and nobody else's okay so i wish you all the best with this and it may not resonate with everyone because it's a general reading but if it do resonates with you please reach out and communicate and ensure that you feel good about yourself once you do that okay the messages from your angel is see connect with your parents maybe some of you really really have not had this parental time a lot of you could be could have lost your parents in the recent past and maybe uh, missing your parents or a parent a lot of you could be parents here and not able to accept the situation with your children so you need to work on that particular healing you need to crumble the crumble those gates of ego and those you know not really ego some situation that lacks communication you need to crumble that and some of you okay could be a clairvoyant uh, could be you know highly connected with spirituality okay so you got to trust in what you see you got to trust in what your mind sees what your eye sees you got to trust you got to trust in your healing you got to trust in your intuition you got to trust in your new beginning okay uh, let me pick another card for you here okay your spirit guide here your spirit guide here is light activation see look at this get into the mode of activating your inner light oh my god this camera is so shaky sanat kumara shine your light your internal guidance is coming through loud and clear okay so you gotta really okay my phone hit 13 13 my camera hit 13 13 sorry you gotta really really focus on your inner light okay you have to focus on your inner light because your inner light is going to this is your light that comes from here and it's going to spread across the entire room you're going to be lit as af you're going to be lit after this reading believe me i have a feeling that you have got the clarity that you're looking for three through this reading so work on your sun to shine bright on you okay and let go of things that did not really serve you right i wish you all the best Clean out the negativity and bring in the positivity, my friends. 11-11, a day to manifest. Light a candle and write a love letter to yourself or to the universe and manifest. And just enjoy the miracles. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. I love you all. Till we meet again. Goodbye.